put out on newsstands and Newsweek just this morning and is already sold out. The selection of Rahm Emanuel is a really inspired choice because um, it's not making the mistake that Bill Clinton made in 92-93, which is hiring people who really had no experience with Washington. And so Rahm's experience uh, both in the White House and presidential decision making, but even more important, is the experience from the Hill. Transition as we speak now is uh, pretty early in its infancy. But a couple of things are very clear. He does not want to wait to make uh, critical appointments. He's already beginning to line people up for White House staff positions, which in Bill Clinton's case didn't happen until comparatively very, very late. And I think one of the lessons learned from the Clinton transition is that it's much better to get your senior White House uh, staff in place quickly. And if, in fact, Congressman Emanuel accepts that job, he's an excellent choice. And I think he brings to um, President-elect Obama a set of skills that are going to be um, very important, especially because... Uh, not to make the mistakes of 92, 93, in which there was some sort of tensions between Congress and the White House. And I think that um, choosing Rahm Emanuel is sending the message that President Obama is going to be very much in charge of an agenda, and he's going to be looking to make it happen. And you can't have someone tougher than Rahm Emanuel. Uh, let's put it this way. He, he's a tough guy, and he will actually help make some of the very difficult decisions. And he's got a, a rare capacity to say no, and you really know he means it. So uh, he's not going to get jerked around by people who might try to take advantage of uh, the president-elect. So I think it's, a, it's an excellent choice, and I think it speaks to the kind of uh, the kind of government that Barack Obama wants to create here. He wants to bring in new people with experience, uh, some who obviously know what the jobs are like, but he wants some people who've got fresh perspectives on issues, and I think he's, he'll have a lot of people in government that uh, reflect that.